outlet. So for $750,000, you too can have a reverse wired outlet that turns off when I open the door. Boom. <laughs> Well, that ain't good. Come on over, we'll have a dip in the hot tub. Found an FPE panel and a Sylvania panel. Two in one spot. I smell termites. Oh yeah. Come on. Oh, someone poking his head out. Come here, little baby. Come on. Come on up there. There he is. Gotcha. Front deck, raining, not very much, hmm, deck's a little bit out of level looks like, they're just going, smell was as you walk in the front door was complaining about, hmm, kind of hit the wall. Oh, look what we got, got a little mold, weeping up the wall. Yeah, with enough water, this fence will grow nice and tall. All right, this is for you, James. A little, oh. little revenge. A little revenge. We're getting them, James. They're just for you. Do you want me to start running? <laughs> <laughs> Die! Oh, dude, get them on the ground. They're all on the ground. <laughs> I can't believe it. It may be true. It looks like this flipper was telling the truth. It is only minor settling. Just some minor settling. Flipper said there's, they've got a pretty good roof going. I'd give it two, hmm, maybe five days left. The flipper said there's been some minor settling. I think there might be a little bit more going on. We'll have to check it out. Oh wow, I think that grout needs some improvement. Let's try the shower. Oh, no, I'm not gonna do that. That's not supposed to happen. Well, got some low flow. How low can you flow? I got some termites. I got some termites. Coming into the attic area, it is very tight.
the ductwork is all touching one another. You can see the condensation all over that one. It's all dripping. Hands all full of water. It's gonna be a chore to get to that water heater, but I'll make it happen. So we got ASV on the front side of this house. I do have the, uh, the through wall flashing, but what they did is they mortared all the way up to the window and you got gaps in the water like that. And come down underneath, there's no weep screen. And that's what their substrate looks like. So not good. So I'm out here on a re-inspection this morning. Um, the first inspection, this dirt was all the way up touching the siding. So look what's uncovered when it's all leveled out. Looks like the builders still got some work to do. Uh-oh. Don't go chasing waterfalls. Just stick to the rivers and the lakes that you used to I know you wanna have it your way or nothing else But baby, it's better this way Too bad. Let's check it with the moisture meter just in case. Bow, bow. Scanning. Oh, 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 it's definitely wet. And it's slightly bowed. Interesting. Underneath the stucco on this porch, this, the weep holes are weeping. Interesting. We have some galvanized water lines. Oh yeah. Looky, looky what I found. Got a little moisture. Think they might have stucco issues. Something we see on every report. Sealing up the storm collar on your gas flues. See some daylight showing it there on the left side. And uh, it is, you know, it's, it's an easy fix, but it's a big deal. It's raining right now. The water's coming down. The wet spot. So you see water stripping down just from that tiny 
daylight showing.